<laughs> Hello, Mr. Van Geller. Mr. Van Geller would like to come inside the house, I think. If he could, he'd follow me to the ends of the earth. Okay, so I got a, um, a duck egg today. It's a big egg. I'm, I'm holding the camera with the other hand, so sorry. Chicken egg, about medium size. Oh, kitties are trying to come inside my house. They're not allowed inside the house. <laughs> I know for you cat lovers, but these are barn ranch kitties. They're not allowed to come inside the house. Um, and because they're, they're supposed to be catching mice around the chicken coop. Anyways, um, and around the house. And then a bantam silky egg. And I really can't compare the sizes very well. But, I mean, hopefully you can still, because I'm squishing them up in my hand, but hopefully you can see duck egg, if you've never even seen this before, a duck egg is quite larger, quite much larger than the chicken egg. And then the bantam egg is like half the size of a regular chicken egg. Well, a little bit bigger than half, but... Um, and I get these... Um, and those little ducks that you've seen, those were, I got those around my birthday time last year. Uh, they lay eggs, um, but I didn't get them for egg laying, but their eggs do taste good. I got them more as like, you know, everybody kind of has a purpose here, of course. These guys lay eggs and such. Um, they do too, of course, that I eat. Um, but the little ducks... I didn't get them just for eating eggs. They're just fun little ducks. And they don't really eat that much, so that's kind of nice. They're... They don't eat so much. They sure make a mess, though. All duckies make a mess. Okay. So, there we go. Actually, I had another... <clears throat> I have another egg. Um, I forgot. I do have another egg. And right now I'm not getting as many eggs as I could be getting uh, because I have chickens hatching babies. And I have sold some chickens, so here's the donkey. <laughs> there's, there's beautiful eyes. Okay. Hello, Teddy. Hi, baby girl. You need something? Oh. Mm -hmm. Tell me all about it. It's not green enough. Not enough green, yeah? <laughs> you're so cute. Oh my goodness, you're just too cute. Did you know that? Did you know you're cute? You can't even see your eyes. <laughs> oh. Must be a... Uh-oh. What is it? Oh. It's a plane, guys. They just warned about something coming. Chickens are so smart. I can't believe people think they're not smart. I guess they probably think it's a great big hawk. This is his favorite spot. He waits here for the little mice to come out of that corner. Day and night. I actually saw him catch a mouse that came out. <laughs> yes, you did. You were a good kitty. Very good kitty. Good barn kitty. You're a very good barn kitty too. The last time I had a barn kitty, it <laughs> kept running off and I realized it was alone oh now that's funny 
My tiny rooster doesn't want the ducks close to his flock. He thinks he's big stuff. Anyways, um, yeah, so something happened to me. So this time, this time I got two kittens in hopes that, um, I'd, one would stay, and that's actually worked out very well because they're both still here. I think my other cat was already gone this age. Two barn kitties. <laughs> this kitty, um, she's got blue eyes and points. Like a flame point Siamese. Actually, people paid lots of money for this kitty. And this kitty, well, you never know what kind of cat you'll get in the gar barn kitten mixes and such because some really nice cats have gotten into those mixes sometimes, so. I like to brag that I got myself a flame point Siamese. <laughs> She's got the little bit orange, orangey sandy color and the piercing blue eyes. Anyways, I'm talking too much. She knows she's beautiful. I got <laughs> can't even remember. <laughs>